Hello everyone, this is your heart message of the week and I wanted to talk about meditation and how you could actually be using meditation to disassociate, to disconnect from your body and to basically um, disconnect yourself from your emotional wounds. And um, a lot of people seem to think that meditation is doing inner work and I just want to make a distinction that it's not. It's a great tool um, to use um, to calm the mind. There's lots of you know good benefits. Um, but in terms of inner work, if you have experienced a lot of emotional wounds, what I see a lot of people do is use meditation to, to disconnect themselves from the actual wound. So they are um, trying to transcend the, the trauma or the emotions without actually processing it, without feeling it, without going through the horrible, <laughs> uncomfortable you know, process of grieving and feeling all the, the horrible pain and all that stuff. Um, and they're just sitting on top of the emotion and just far enough that they can't feel it. So very often they people seem to think that they've, they're have they over something or that they've transcended it and um, and they haven't, basically, they're delusional. <laughs> so um, you may be using meditation to disconnect and disassociate and that is not going to help you. That's going to make the situation um, maybe not necessarily worse, but it's going to keep you stuck in patterns. And um, you're just using meditation as a little band-aid, basically, to give yourself a little feel-good um, in the moment, like instant you know, relief. Um, but you'll never have that, you know, breakthrough that you're looking for because you can't transcend, you know, emotional wounds. You have to go through it. You have to face it. You have to feel it. You have to grieve it. Um, and it's only when you do that, that you'll be able to transcend or, um, go beyond it. And so those of you who have experienced a lot of, you know, deep emotional wounds, I would actually recommend you do you can do meditations to reconnect to your body to take to bring your consciousness your soul inside your body not outside <laughs> out there somewhere um reconnect to your body but also um know that once you start to do this emotions may come up so the next step is then once emotions and things do come up obviously you have to face it um and if you're not ready then, or if it's too overwhelming for you, then obviously I do recommend you get help. See a coach or a healer or a therapist or anybody that can sort of hold the space for you um, to process your wounds and that can guide you through um, your healing journey. Anyway, I hope that helps. Um, and if you have any questions, you can always comment below or message me. That's it for today. Bye for now.